stop listening. This is Doctor Who Dalek Hack, a game which teaches you some coding and wiring, and I'm fairly sure it will be fully playable with voice finger. Let's go. Start listening. Mouse. India Kilo. Keyboard. Daleks have a bomb. We need to hack one to get rid of the bomb. Mouse. Tango Papa. Tango P. Keyboard. Mouse. Echo Echo. Echo Echo. Keyboard. My ice cream Dalek. Mouse. Kilo P. Keyboard. Need to power it up. And wire it. Mouse. Mark left. Oscar Golf. November Kilo. Mark left. Oscar P. Lima K. Mark left. Bravo C. Juliet Kilo. Keyboard. Mouse. Uniform Kilo. So power and motor is going, now let's tweak the code. Keyboard. Mouse. 8 Bravo. 9 Foxtrot. Bravo Bravo. Charlie Charlie. North. 9 Alpha. Keyboard. Click left. Click left. Click left. Mouse. 9P. Keyboard. Nice. Great work! Mouse. IP. Keyboard. The block. The path is blocked. Stop listening. So in our code we'll have to go up, turn right, blast, and then keep going right. I think. Mark left. Alpha November. Hotel Kilo. Uniform Kilo. Keyboard. Stop listening. So like before, I'll be moving up four times. Navigate the corner is probably the mode to choosing to turn right. Taking care of the obstacle will be to blast. But then there are no further options. However, there's a loop counter at the top. If you looped that a second time, then once the thing is blasted, it would move forward four times. And though it has more instructions, that would actually get it to the exit orb. Start listening. Mouse. Bravo Delta. Bravo Delta. Bravo Delta. Bravo Delta. Bravo P. Keyboard. Stop listening. Excellent. I'm totally not getting spotted by that. Great by work! Dark. This is the most exciting coding I've ever done. With the background music. Start listening. Mouse. IP. Keyboard. Door locks. 
Mouse. Uniform Delta. Mark left. Bravo Lima. Foxtrot Kilo. Uniform Lima. Keyboard. Stop listening. What I do depends on the route I go. You'll go up, turn left or right, go up. Move, turn up. Destroy obstacle. Up one, right one, face up, deal with obstacle. Left one, up one, deal with obstacle. Up one, left one. I see a pattern here is not very helpful commenting. Note the difference between turn left and move left. And maybe we're lucky that move left keeps it facing the same direction and therefore there is a way to deal with these obstacles, because otherwise it's impossible. So under that assumption, after doing that twice we'll be here with nothing in front of us. So then we'll move up, move to the right, deal with the obstacle, move up, move to the right, and be finished. Bravo, Quebec. Keyboard. Stop listening. Nice. Dull! Oh. Yeah. I hope it doesn't reset the whole thing. Start listening. Click left. Mouse. North. South. Bravo India. South. Charlie Mike. Bravo P. Keyboard. Stop listening. I stalk wire. Well done! <laughs> Only two stars because I made one mistake in my code. Start listening. Mouse. IP. Keyboard. Mouse. Uniform Delta. Keyboard. We need to replace a part. Now we won't need the manipulator because there's nothing to manipulate, but we will still need the motor and the blaster and the eye stalk. Mouse. Mark left. Alpha Golf. Foxtrot Kilo. Uniform Lima. Keyboard. Stop listening. So I think the rule should be if the eye stalk sees nothing in the square immediately in front, we move forward. If it sees a block, we blast it, and if it sees a wall, we turn right. And that's how you get around the spiral. Start listening. Mouse. Stop listening. So if you don't see a wall, or you don't see nothing, just blast. Mouse. CP. Keyboard. Stop listening. Yes. Start listening. Great work. Mouse. India P. Keyboard. Stop listening. So I don't want to blast them. I'm really tempted to blast them though. I think there isn't even a way to do it without the voice identification. Because if you move forward, if you're all like, turn right at a wall and Blast if you see a Dalek. 
you'd actually get stuck between this square and the one or three to the left of it. Because you'd go forwards, or rather left, then up, and then, and then right, and then down, and then just to the left, and then to the right, back and forth. Mark left. 9Q. HK. Exterminate! Uniform Lima. Keyboard. So I think it's if there's nothing in front of us, move forward. I assume that when you meet a Dalek and identify yourself, it moves away from the middle. Because then that makes a sensible path left and right. So you want a rule that if it sees a Dalek, it will send communication then move forward and then turn right. Don't know how it works when they get out of the way. Start listening. Mouse. Alpha 7. Oh. That's a spoiler with the comments. Echo 7. Bravo Golf. Charlie Delta. I'll be sensible. So I've said that whenever it's there's nothing in front of you, keep moving. So then the deductions are if there's something in front of you, what do you do? Having already said there's a da Dalek, get out of the way. I suppose you then sent turn right and then turn around if you see a wall. Start listening. Seven, eight. Let's give it a go. Alpha Q. Stop listening. Stop listening. Keyboard. I am a Stop listening. Ah, no. So when it sees something that's not a wall or a Dalek, and not nothing, it still turns right. I am a and Dalek. That fits. Fantastic. Great work. Do I print? Start listening. Mouse. Mike Quebec. South. Z Romeo. Six seven. Keyboard. Stop listening. This was fab. I imagine it could also be played with the mouse grid of Dragon Naturally Speaking and Windows Speech Recognition, and even Mouse Sense with some clicking macros. But yeah, very exciting coding. It's a shame they don't have more of these.